All right, I said how much excited I was for the video game, so I think it only makes sense I should talk about the TV show. And what do I think about the TV show? I'm going to get all my opinions out on what other TV show, and I'm going to get some hopes and, uh, hopes and pretty much just my opinion and my hopes, hopefully, that will be answered. First of all, I want to just say the animation. Now, this is the first uh, animation that uses well, pretty, well, CGI show. I mean, the other shows look like they were hand-drawn, and I like that. But this is CGI animation, and it looks great. You have to admit that. Not only does the ground look so much more great... I mean, look at Eggman's jacket. Just look at Eggman's jacket. It is so good. There's so much detail put into it. And the humor. Eh, it kinda, the humor kind of feels like it's from the video game, so I actually don't mind the humor at all. And I'm going to talk about the voice actors, too. Um, hmm. Sonic's going to be voiced by Roger Craig Smith. I think I like the voice, because it's, well, it's Roger Craig Smith. If you don't know who he is, he's voiced Ezio from Assassin's Creed, and Batman from Origins, and Black Gate. I guess that image finally makes sense now, doesn't it? I'm Sonic. Sonic the Hedgehog. And I'm Batman. Tails is also getting a new voice by Colleen Villard. I think that's how her name is pronounced. She's actually done a lot of good voice acting in her day too. And um, I'm not going to say much about her because seriously, you just need to check it out for yourself. Amy, Amy's going to be voiced by Sydney Robinson. I hope she sounds better than the voice from Lost Worlds because she sounds like a total wuss. And Knuckles is going to be voiced by Travis Willingham, who is from Sonic uh, Generations. And if you didn't like that voice, well, you kind of get it here. But I don't know how he sounds in the show, so we'll have to wait till the show comes out. Dr. Eggman is going to be voiced by Mike Pollock. Polak? Pol Pol I don't know how to say this, but <clears throat> sorry. He sounds really good. I have to admit that. He sounds very good. He sounds Eggman. He just sounds Eggman. That's all I could say. Eggman. Oh yeah, you remember when I said how I liked the humor because it was just like the video game? It seemed very like the video game humor? Well, that's another reason I like this show, because it's because it really does feel like it will be like the video games. I'm not going to say that um, it, it'll be like the video games, I'm just saying maybe the character interactions and and the humor will all be from like the video game. I don't think they're going to try to add anything modern or anything. I feel like it'll just be like the video games and it's humor. And that is why I'm excited because I really just want that. I want humor like that. I mean, it just shows me that they really do care for the Sonic fan base. Yeah, so that's what I kind of, that's why I really am excited for the show. I mean, come on. You kind of have to admit, you kind of saw the whole Egghead joke coming, right? Just hope he doesn't change his name to Egghead now, because Robotnik would have had a bunch of names changed from Dr. Robotnik to Eggman to Egghead. Can anyone else see that coming? Alright, just stop trying to get around it, and let's just talk about the redesigns. Now, this has been talked about a lot. People have made fun of some redesigns, a lot of people's, um, I have never actually heard a bunch of positive stuff, I mean I've heard people said they are, they're alright with it, but never have I actually heard people said, yeah, I like these re new redesigns, but then again, they don't really have much, a lot of characters don't have that much changed about them. I mean, let's take Sonic's redesign, he just has a bit more spines on his head, I mean, literally, if you put the new design right next to the old design, it kind of does look like he has more spines. And he has he's wearing bandages. No, I'm not going to call it sports tape because bandages make it look more badass. And, um, that's pretty much it, besides the brown scarf. So, Sonic's now wearing a scarf. That's like the new uh, fashion going on in the Sonic universe. You know, you're not wearing a scarf, you're just... Not in Sonic fashion. A doy. Don't even talk to me. And Tails' redesign, he's just wearing a sash and goggles. That's pretty much it. And some bandages on his feet. Still not calling it sports tape. 
Other than that, I still say it's good. Nothing wrong with it. And now we have Amy's redesign. To show you how much I care for this redesign, I decide to play as Amy in Sonic All-Star Racing Transformed, and I'll say this. I will show you how much I care for this redesign. Oh, what? I lost the race, but I tried so hard to win. I guess this shows how much I care about this character. So now you know how much I care for this redesign. And the character in general. So, yeah. Does this answer your question on how much I care for the redesign? And now, Knuckles' redesign. Uh, where's the redesign? That, that's not a redesign. That's a guy on steroids. Where's the redesign? Oh, yeah, right. They 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 went with that approach. Ugh, the jokes can just range from anywhere on this redesign. I look. I understand why you made the redesign of Knuckles like this, but. It's just so stupid. Well, actually, I shouldn't say that. I read the comics, and I've seen many buff characters, but I guess it's just surprising to see that just Knuckles being like that. I don't know. I didn't I kind of like the way he originally looked, but there's nothing. Is do we really need? Knuckles on steroids? No, I mean, really? Is this how it's gonna be portrayed for the rest of the Sonic universe? Steroid guy? Huh? Uh, someone answer me! And now for Eggman's redesign. And I have to say, out of all the redesigns, this is my favorite because. Eggman just looks more like a general now, and usually when I think of bad guys for TV shows, I think generals. I don't know why, I just think generals. Overall, I'm excited for the TV show because I feel, I feel like it's just going to be just like the video games. I feel like the voice actors will do a nice job representing the characters. And that's about it. Please like this video, share it with your friends, and hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out.